Hello, anyone and everyone. Welcome back to Ed Trial playing Children of Morta. So I know it's been what two weeks, three weeks. It's been far too long. I've uh, meant to. Ooh, ooh, ooh. When light faded from the sky and most were fast asleep, Mary would write about her family, immortalizing them for future generations. A nice little bit of lore. Alright, I haven't played this game since we left, last left off, and that's kind of hard. Every time I want to, I'm like, I can't play this game because I haven't, you know, done my video of this, or my second video of this game. Because I did my first video, and I said I would do a second video, but, uh, you know, here we are. We're gonna beat the Silk Caverns on this run. Easy. Who are we gonna play as? Linda. Get ready to play one of them, okay. Sorry, John. Be more interesting. But yeah, I uh, recorded like four hours of raft, but like I doubt I'm gonna do anything with that footage. Recorded some other stuff that I doubt I'm gonna do anything with. So basically, I haven't uploaded. I intended to upload, and I just kept doing a bunch of actually not uploading, which is kind of silly. And uh, all right, gotta be careful. My A button is stuck. I might use up all my stamina rolling. There it is. Oh, that's gonna be going pretty well. I forgot this was a twin stick shooter. I was using X to shoot instead of that, or with my right stick. This is a whole lot easier. Uh, I hope my recording is sounding fine. Maybe I can turn this down a little bit. Maybe. Oh. That. I should probably turn down the narrator. And no, we're not going to turn down the narrator. His voice is beautiful and that's all you really want to listen to, I'm sure. But yeah, I meant to do more recordings of this, but unfortunately I, I'm, I suck and I didn't do it. Besides, there's also a secondary playthrough, which... I don't expect that many people to watch this one. Not many people watch my videos initially, but I expect that like, even less so to watch this one. Because, one, they'll be like, I already saw this game, or, you know, they'll be like, oh, I haven't watched the first video, which you think would prompt them to watch the first video, but more than likely will just, more than likely will just deter them from watching this video. That's okay. So we're gonna make this video for people, Steven, who wanted to see more of this, and I wanted to play more of it, but honestly, after this video, I'm just gonna play this game by myself. A lot of times, I'll set up the notion that like I'll, I can only play this for a recording, or I can't play this until I record it, and then that usually stops me from playing the game altogether. Because I'll be like, no, I can't record it because of this. I can't record it because of this, and all these other reasons and excuses. Oh, excuse me, sir. Hero, dude. Linda's fucking ferocious and I love her. Linda. Also, I was also tempted to... Attempt. I was interested in maybe doing a recording with, like, a friend while I played this game because this is co-op. Local co-op, I believe. I'm not sure if it's online co-op. But, yeah. Like, you know, show the co-op aspect. Show, to give more variation to what I've already shown in the game. Which is just basically me just going through the first area of the Silk Caverns. Except we're gonna win, obviously. We're gonna make a way more powerful play. Because Linda's too strong. Everything is easy because I'm playing Linda. Ooh, it dodged it by just being Linda. Because I'm better than you. Tactical place. I hit that plan on purpose with great knowledge of what would happen afterwards. Easy money. So yeah, I'm recording this Christmas Eve. I'm going to probably have two videos go up this uh, week. Maybe three, but that's ridiculous. I have... A decent amount of footage. One, two, yeah. Oh, hello. No, no loot. I've also been playing a lot of Apex Legends. 
That's been pretty fun. I don't know if I'll record that. But, uh... We're going down through this gate. But it's funny, because after this recording, I know I'll be playing a lot more Children of Mortal because this is been fun. I just haven't finished to play it, but I just... I mean, this is basically after this video. I'll be allowed to play this as much as I want, mainly because I don't think... Again, I was initially going to make this video like a series, but then I was like, yeah, people don't, people don't watch it, so it's no big deal. This channel was mainly made to be a, this is my first impression of a new thing. You guys should check it out. And that's serving its purpose. This is the boss room. Challenge room. Not challenge room, item room. Totem of warding. Create a totem that shoots enemies surrounding it. Badass. Way longer cooldown than I thought it'd be. What are you shooting at? Brother! There you go. Brother, you're missing! Brother, you're missing again. Brother, your shots aren't that good, brother. Oh wow. That was. That's very cool until you realize that it is a dub. Uh, so he teleports that thing to the left. That's cool. Um. Okay, yeah, there's more to go. I was backtracking because I figured out I had more that I didn't explore. And I said he was going straight down. I figured I'd finish out this whole thing. Because in the last one, I'm pretty sure I just ran straight to the boss level. Because for some reason, I felt like time was of the essence. Because I only have so much time to retain. Oh, I remember because I. Made a mistake in my previous recording of Children of Morta. No, not previous. Not the one that I uploaded. My initial recording of Children of Morta, I read, I remember now. It was way too long on accident. And so I made sure that my next recording wouldn't be nearly as long. So it was more I had to rush the boss because time was of the essence in my mind. And it was not really. Back off. Chumps. Give me the keys to the kingdom. You gave me a key to the kingdom. I shall not open it. Only gold. I'm okay with that. Auspicious. A bounty awaited those who can defeat the god of games. God of games. Pong of the gods. Oh yeah, I'm supposed, to, I'm supposed to hit the chest? Okay, clearly. It's not like real Pong, I want to hit the paddle. The enemy paddle is not trying. Yeah, the enemy paddle is just letting me hit it. Do I have to hit it on the side? I like how there's Pong in this. I really do. Like, it's not even any bit of sarcasm. I'm just a little... <gasps> I'm just a little... You have to hit it on the side. So smart. Health. Take that god of the game. <laughs> that is awesome. Alright, let's um uh, I believe we hold up the teleport. That waypoint that I saw. Heck yeah. And we go down. Damn damn I don't actually know. Alright. Funny, we're going down sugar run. Doesn't matter. We're going down swinging regardless. Era. Hello, armored skeleton. Creature of hate and bone and hate. I thought I shot that in the wrong direction. I'm so happy that it hit them. I did a no shot. I didn't even look at them, dude. They piss off a lot of people in the background.
We're really bad. We got ourselves cornered so many times. And gemstone. Oh, big spider. Go, my useful totem. Crush them. Is that dude laying down the law? Hell yeah, brother. Totem of shooting. Shoot them, totem. Linda, no. Oh yeah, I forget. If I stand still and don't strafe, I can just conserve my stamina. Sir. Oh, you're shitting. You're not shooting your poison at me. Ah! Why did you die and spawn spiders? It's like the worst aspect of fighting spiders in video games. You kill them and they're like, my babies were on me. And it's like, that's not comfort. I don't know if like you want me to kill your babies. They're just gonna hit on top of you and not reveal themselves. Very not good survival instincts. Oh no, we're aggroing so many monsters. Oh, that looks like a boss room. Oh, that's the first time I take damage. I'm very sad. Dude, we ran them through the gauntlet. That was a, that was a secret gauntlet skill. I almost watched the spike. So oh, don't spit at me. Or. What, do you th what direction? Is that coming from her butt or her mouth? Either way, I don't want it. I'm just curious. Hello? Hmm, total warding. Heal a portion of your. Can I just. Alright, cool. <laughs> Use the potion and then put it down. I don't want that potion. Potion delay. Using a potion implies that I'm gonna ever get hit. I know I got hit earlier, but like that was a fluke. What a stupid dead end. <laughs> but it's all right. Oh no, there's a chosen champion following me. What is this nonsense? Stop him. Stop him. He's moving far too fast. Thank God. That guy's moving far too fast for any sort of comfort. That's rude. Applying will ever get hit. Oh, I, web like, I saw the web on my character model. Ah! I knew I was screaming, but that was my war cry. Looks like a war chain. I hear your, I hear your pitter patters. Get that! Ah! Get that shit out of here. I know it would be more unsettling, the fact that I hear their pitter patter, or if I couldn't hear them coming, I just, you know, just, just, all those legs are just deadly silent, like these babies, but they're not, babies aren't that deadly, for me, Frank. I mean, you're, you, you can see what happened here. Maybe I need that soul. Oh, not soul, it's gemstone. I need the gemstone. So many spiders. Back. 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 Hmm, <coughs> <coughs> pardon me. Happy holidays, I coughed in your ear. Linda just seems so fun compared to her father. I mean, he's he's normally what I play, like this very sword and board type, but... Anyway, it's fun is fun. And that's just a fact, like Ag, Agatha, Jermaine, and Jack. 
Ooh. Fish in a barrel. You fat spider, you will not shoot me. You will not spit at me, you fat spider. Man, there's so much more to explore in this godforsaken dungeon. Okay. This is the first real playthrough. I actually like how big the maps are. It says two floors, but like, good lord, the second floor is mass. What is this? Um, creates a tone that distracts. I just want to see what it looks like. That's cool, I guess. Full tip. Uh -huh. Dude, what find various. Oh, I need to find ingredients. Oh, that's what I'm doing. Where are the ingredients? What strange thing could have dragged Grandmother this far? Grandmama. The will of Rhea will flow in those still obelisks to aid the guardians. This was the only thing Margaret silently whispered. Grandmama. Yeah, face this fuck boy. Another one? Watch for a limited time. I already know what this is. I'm faster than you. Ah! What a sad and cruel thing I had to there. Fast. What is this one? I'm not near any combat. Ah, go. Use our ex limited time buff. I must gain experience. Shit. I'm here for the experience. If I should be going for here. Boss battle? Boss battle. All eight eyes studied the one so willing to walk into their own tomb. Yeah. I've seen Lord of the Rings. I'm not afraid of you. Maybe I should have. Ah! I need to look out for the big guy. That's what I need to do. I'm like focusing on these small fries way too much. I mean, obviously, I need to. You know, because that, like, landing thing is pretty bad. Brother. I was doing so well. A set of daggers made just for him. They would be his guide to finding himself, his focal point. The boy tested them. They felt good, not too heavy, not too light, like an extension of himself. Thorfinn. Uncle Ben suggested a few practice swings outside. The daggers sliced the air, guided with an easy grace. His nephew was clearly a natural with the blades and would be ready to join his father and sister in no time. Oh, mom's upset. But the boy's mother had words on that subject. Two of her children were already risking their lives, and she would not have her precious little boy out there as well. Regretfully, he took the daggers away. 
Who was he to argue with a mother when it involved her child? Handing over the daggers was like abandoning a part of himself. He was meant for them, meant to be out there fighting for what was right. He just needed to convince them. Don't cry, brother. It's not convincing them that you're ready for battle. Oh, I thought I got a new character. strengthen the family. The mysteries of the world were like open books to the wise, and words from the wise shall benefit man and beast. Alright, well, that was, boom, episode 2 of Ed Draw Plays Children of Morta. Ironically, after uh, I played the first episode and I knew I couldn't play any more Children of Morta, I played some Moonlighter, which is made by the same people, to get a, a feel or a vibe for it, you know what I mean? So I have a Lord thing with Grandma. That's gonna be for me, not you guys. If you guys are gonna have to buy the game, check it out yourself. <laughs> Suckers. Alright, catch you guys next time. Peace out. called Riding the Bull. <laughs>